Hey, what's up everybody? Mirko Rosa here. I'm an animal fitness trainer. That means I take care of the body preparation and condition for animal. I do this with dog, with cat, with tiger, lion, leopard and many other animals. I do this job for more than 12 years and today I want to talk to you about something very particular and something very uh, difficult to explain in another language for me English I'm Italian and so I will try to speak very slowly and I try to make everything everybody can understand because this is a very mm, particular uh, technical things okay we're gonna talk about the diet for dog but not only for the diet we're gonna talk about the vegetarian and vegan diet for dog and cat okay so that point is very complicated to understand and it's very complicated to explain it's very complicated everything so we go very slowly and we try to understand first of all we must say that dog and cat are carnivorous okay they eat meat cat more than dog uh, they are carnivorous so they need meat chicken tuna and so on, so on, so on. But, but, we can talking about vegetarian diet. That's why we make this video. F start talking about the cat, okay? Cat cannot, cannot make vegetarian diet or vegan diet because he need a nutritional, uh, nutritional principle, and you can found only meat in fish, in eggs, in milk and uh, in uh, and in, in the fat okay in the animal fat so if you make uh, i i never do it and uh, is not i will never do it even with my company uh, vegetarian diet for cat never make it never okay but if you make it he need a lot a lot of supplement okay because he lose i have many many mineral he lose a lot so you need a lot of supplement and regularly controlled by the vet regularly regularly because it's very dangerous diet so it does make no sense to make a vegetarian diet for cat okay now we're talking about the dog dog is however is different story also dog is carnivorous but the dog is also omnivorous okay it's possible is possible follow vegetarian diet for dog not vegan vegetarian diet is possible to do it but we must remember something vegetal protein is less digestible digestible and make uh, it can make a lot of deficit on the body of the animal you can lose calcium because of iron zinc uh, and etc etc and also you can make a lot a lot of problem with the digestible of vitamin e b e 12 b uh, sorry b12 vitamin e vitamin d so he can make a lot a lot of trouble so when we use a vegetarian diet for dog we use when the dog is intolerant to the animal protein so when the animal when the dog is intolerant to animal protein we introduce the vegetarian diet in his life and with supplement of course the thing is guys is very important to understand that animal they cannot make vegetarian because is a you like it because you are vegetarian or because uh, is a, a style make my dog is vegetarian you cannot make like that okay they need they you do this when they are sick then they cannot eat animal protein so you must found a solution the vegetarian diet is born for solution not for follow a moda or something like that okay so when the dog is intolerant to the animal protein you go change you go in the vegetarian diet and you need a very specific diet when we make a diet for dog normally before to give the diet we spend more than two weeks talk with the doctor because it's very complicated it's very complicated and it's very dangerous very dangerous sometimes it's more dangerous than giving the uh, not dog intolerant food for dog so because you can really destroy your animal okay and uh, we provide with me me and my company we provide some vegetarian uh, diet for dog and uh, but only when really necessary only when it's necessary because it's very complicated believe me it's not easy because 
animal need everything need vitamin E, vitamin B12, vitamin K, uh, iron, zinc, uh, everything, everything, and everything. So, for cat, never, never do. I will never do. For dog, we do only in some situation, only in some situation when it's necessary. Uh, it's very important guys sorry it's very important you understand that it's not because you want your dog is vegetarian okay you need a vegetarian diet when when he's sick okay so you need to change his diet okay guys thank you for following this episode as the animal empire podcast show and um share this with all your friends they think they want to give a vegetarian diet for the animal and uh, thumbs up if you like and write a comment if you have any question i speak very slowly guys because i want you understand what what i say because it's very important you understand it's very important what we talk about that so it's very important you understand cat cannot okay by the way we not do dog is possible only when it's very necessary if it's not necessary it's, it's not possible okay thank you guys have a nice day thank you for follow the page thank you for follow youtube thank you so much you can follow found me also in um, in facebook mirko rosa animal fitness expert there is many video and many uh, very short video about training about workout what we know have here on youtube and instagram saying mirko rosa animal fitness expert okay thank you so much enjoy the rest of the day and fall keep give a good food for your animal bye